palms of the hands back towards the compassion chakras on either side of the heart. So the palms of the hands sitting somewhat below your collarbone and the fingers pointing towards the heart chakra. Just allow them to lay on the heart as I speak. I am Sananda. I am Sananda speaking from the silver ray. I am Sananda speaking to all of you today. The light indeed moves and penetrates deeper into the surface of the earth, into the atmosphere of the earth, into the flesh and bones of all living beings, into the vertebrae, in through the breath, and out through the sun itself, shining greater vibrations of light into the earth. And so you may find the light difficult at times. You may find the light bothering you at times. <clears throat> you may find yourself more irritated or hypersensitive. This hypersensitivity is a reaction to the light. The different um, feelings that you've had in the body, if you notice them over the past three months, you'll recognize how you are reacting to the penetration or the infusion of light in your being. If you are growing deeper, calmer, more aware of the beauty of the world, if you are feeling a vibration deep within you despite what happens around you and despite your thoughts that may be chaotic, chaotic if at the same time you can feel a depth of peace, of harmony and awareness, then you will recognize that you are holding the light in greater and greater portions. Now then, we don't mean to say that each one of you is not holding light. You are all holding light. You are holding light at different varying degrees based on what you've come here to do and your own personal process. We wish to speak to you this evening of this idea of grief and grieving. Much was learned and shared during the age of Pisces. Much was brought to humankind through the energy of the vibration of the lifetime that I lived during that time. I was known as Jesus the Christ, and I walked the earth bringing the vibration of brotherly love as other masters walked the earth bringing the same vibration. I was the tip of the iceberg. There were many thousands of others as myself who were coming in bringing the idea of blood, brotherly love and brotherly, a brotherly sisterly love of human awareness for others. You see, the human being has gone through several phases of advancement. The human being meaning the body or the vessel that your soul vibrates in at this time. You have been raising the vibration of this material form through your incarnations, many they have been, and through the different ages and the awareness in each age. And so the individual human being had to understand awareness and compassion for others beyond family or beyond those that were tribal or keeping you uh, part of your living had to stretch beyond to the understanding of others. And so we brought this awareness into the planet through the idea of sacrifice, through the idea of caring for one another, through the idea of putting another before self. And that idea took some time to root and change into a vibratory wave of energy on the planet. You see, you are experiencing a wave of energy now. You're experiencing the new age taken root. Not taking root, but taken root. It is already rooted, and you're experiencing the transmutation process of the vibration of changing the material form yet again with this new vibratory energy that has been infusing the earth for some time. So it's like stirring an herb into a pot and changing the flavor of the liquid in the pot and changing the um, even uh, form of the liquid in the pot. Perhaps it thickens, perhaps it thins, perhaps it changes flavor, perhaps it changes color. So, when the energy vibrations come at the beginning and the ending of an age into the earth, they take that time, that 2,000 year period, they take that time to 
um, penetrate, to permeate, to shift, to become one with the old age. So you're in the process of the new age and the old age merging. As it merges, friction causes. As the light continues to come in, it helps push the merger of those two vibrations and frequencies together. And so this silver ray, a silver ray of the, um, of the loving acceptance, the silver ray of the understanding of another's suffering, the silver ray of the Messiah energy, the silver ray of the Savior energy, is mixing with a gold crystalline ray now, a cold crystalline transmutational ray that is bringing us into this new age of transmutation. Turn the